Hello class, this is the invisible teacher again with the 16th talk in the series um, where I am discussing primarily Swinburne and um, other things along the way. Um, now I, I am still hoping to get along to the um, comparison between the two Christmas carols um, that's Dickens' Christmas Carol and Swinburne's Christmas Carol. Um, now, Dickens was a senior of Swinburne. Um, well, they would have been writing, the, the time they were writing was in a way parallel. Um, and also, it was the time that Turner as well was drawing um paintings of of um that look beautiful but are probably indicative of of the industrialization in uh, london at the time now what's mostly forgotten um is that many of the pre-raphaelite artists were actually living in central london um dante gabriel rossetti and Lizzie Siddle, um, who was his ma model, and Swinburne were uh, firm friends. Um, well, th there may have been some worry about their friendship. Maybe Swinburne admired Lizzie Siddle. Um, maybe he also liked Dante Gabriel Rossetti. Like Lizzie Siddle, the beautiful ginger-haired, um, well, no, I, I really do prepare uh, to call it um, brass-haired um, model in, um, in many of Dante Gabriel Rossetti's paintings. Um, I think she, Swinburne also had copper or brass hair. Um, so when Swinburne was writing about the Three Marys and talking about their beautiful hair, he may have been imagining, well imagining Lizzie Siddle and also feeling an identification himself with that alternative um, religion almost, because I think what happened was uh, the times in London were so terrible at the time with child poverty, women, women's rights not yet having come into place, um, the Industrial Revolution, the smog probably. They needed icons. They needed some alternative... Uh, each picture of Dante Gabriel Rossetti is like an icon and they and Lizzie Siddle is set up as someone to worship a beautiful well actually according to um to um a book written by um Charles Dickens um granddaughter Lizzie Siddle actually um, went through a very tough time. She worked in a hat shop when she was um, picked up and um, charmed and got to know Daniel Gabriel Rossetti. And um, she was considered too tall to, to be um, beautiful at that time. And he took what might have been in those days considered an ugly duckling and showed its tremendous her tremendous power and beauty but unfortunately the whole of the i don't know whether swinburne was actually and i don't understand why he has been maligned but the others haven't been so much um there was a terrible laudanum problem in london at that time as well and Lizzie Siddle particularly um, was the victim of it. 
um, Charles Dickens' granddaughter describes how um, Swinburne and Gabriel, Dante Gabriel Rossetti were, because Dante or Gabriel Rossetti did marry Lizzie Siddle. Now, that would have been an unusual thing to do as well, to, for an artist actually to marry his model. Um, but still, she was worried, apparently, that he might have been cheating on her. Maybe Swinburne... Well, maybe Dante Gabriel Rossetti was worried that Swinburne was having something to do with um, Lizzie Siddle. Um, but... Anyway, I do. It, it does. I, I've I've posted up here the um, the um, the painting of Proserpina. Um, that's the um, the the woman of the underworld. Well, who was abs who was taken off to the underworld against her wishes, and probably raped by the underlord and um who everybody wishes would come back apparently is a cycle rather like the jesus cycle unfortunately it seems to involve a lot of destruction and sorrow and pain um and that's explained as being part of the order of things and I don't really think, and I don't really think that Swinburne thought it should be the order of things. Um, Swinburne, you will see in the Penguin edition of um, Swinburne's poems that's available on Amazon, um, one of the poems included in that is The Garden of Proserpina. Um, and you will you will be able to read what sympathy and empathy he felt for probably Lizzie Siddle. Now, there's also an awful story that Dante Gabriel Rossetti buried um, a book of poems with Lizzie Siddle when she died, and then later regretted it and actually dug up her grave to get the book of poems. So why Swinburne is falsely maligned, who, as, as it seems, was the more the innocent party in all of this, I'm not really sure. Um, I will read The Garden of Proserpina to you another time. I'll just keep this quite short for now. Um, but... <laughs> Really, um, the surprising thing that art history lifts, leaves out when we're looking at these paintings, and certainly my education in art history missed out, the context of London in about the, well, the, 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 the big flow of it would have been about the 1870s. Dante Gabriel Rossetti died at about 55, I think. So, um, yeah. And in the um, a painting of Proserpina, um, we can see that um, the, uh, the model is in a very, very awkward position with her hands. And to have had to stay there for a long time like that... Um, must have been difficult for her. Now, whether the model is actually Lizzie Siddle, or is someone else, or an imagined thing of Lizzie Siddle, um, you know, we don't particularly know. Some of the paintings seem to portray with darker hair, and some with her brassy um, copper hair. Um, so I've got no idea again there's Dante Gabriel Rossetti may have been having affairs we may also think that the um model in the paintings is very masculine um that could it could be the case that there is a man involved as well dressing up as Liddy Siddle um, in which case it would have been also very sad for Lizzie Siddle.
But there was an interest at the time in androgyny as well, perhaps. I mean, um, some of the spiritual things that used to be going on about those times involved figures such as homunculus, who were a mixture of, well, who were neither male nor female. And in a way, um, we see something that is lifted above the what history of art has usually done with women and portrayed them naked and um, so on, there, there is, by maybe masculinizing her more than how she was in real life, um, actually Dante Gabriel Rossetti um, makes it to a place of religious beauty um, without any, well, there is the um, the Proserpina may be taken to the darker underworld, and um, she does have her um, pomegranate with her, um, but really um, there is nothing so gruesome as Saint Sebastian and so forth. Um, I will leave it there for now.